Hi my loves, so in this video I'm going to be showing you how to achieve this simple hairstyle with your natural hair, so let's get into it. So I start off my hair already tangled, I'm going to go ahead and pass my hair at the left hand side. Please when passing your hair, make sure to take your time and you're definitely going to get it. After I was done on one side, I went ahead to the other side and I replicated the same thing. Now, when I was parting my hair, I was not going for a straight line parting. I was going for a C parting, more like a C curve. And after I was done, this is what my hair looks like. And this is what your hair should look like. After I was done parting both sides of my hair, I went ahead to the back of my hair and I'm just going to create a straight line there. While I was done, this is what the back of my hair is looking like. I went ahead to the rest of my hair and I'm just going to put that away so it doesn't get to obstruct me and I began working with the front. So to the front of my hair, I'm going to go ahead and create a straight line section and after I was done with that, this is what it looks like. I'm going to go ahead and put the rest of my hair away so it doesn't get to obstruct me. So I came back to this section and I'm just going to apply my Echo Starter Crystal Gel. After I was done, I went ahead with my hairbrush and I'm just going to brush that out. Now after I was done, I put them all together and I'm just going to go ahead with my tiny rubber band and I'm going to tighten it properly so it doesn't get to loose. After I was done with this tiny section, this is what it looks like. I'm going to go ahead and replicate the same thing to the rest of the hair I sectioned earlier. After I was done with all three sections, this is how they turned out or this is what they look like. I'm going to go ahead and braid it out. Now to make this braid out easy, I braided the first one a little bit and I'm going to go ahead and join it with the second one. Now I braided those two together, the first and the second one and I'm going to go ahead and join it together with the third one. With this way, it's going to be so easy for you to implement. Now, while I was braiding this, I didn't braid the hair all the way to the tip. I braided it for a little bit and I'm just going to leave the tip that way because I'm still going to join it to the rest of my hair. After I was done with that braid, I went ahead and I just took out my hair tie. I'm going to go ahead and apply my Echo Starter Crystal Gel to the rest of my hair and I'm going to go ahead and brush it out. Now the secret to achieving a slick bun on natural hair is actually brushing. You can go ahead and spray water but I felt like there was no need because you can see that slick down already. I'm going to go ahead and do the same thing to the other side and I just brushed it out properly. I'm going to go ahead and secure my hair together. I'm going to put all my hair together including the braids and I just went ahead and I secured it. I went ahead to the back of my hair and I'm just going to brush that out quickly and I'm going to go ahead and tie it up. Now I formed a bond and if you really want to know how to form this bond at the back of your hair or when tying your natural hair, please do well to check my description. I already explained in one of my videos. And after I was done, I went ahead to apply my hair pin on my hair. It is actually optional, but I just use it to cover up the rubber band. It is best to use the black rubber band. After I was done, I used my edge control and I'm just going to slick my edges down. And this is the final result, guys. For this next hairstyle, I'm going to go ahead and create a pattern at the middle, just a straight line pattern. And after I was done, this is what it looks like. I went ahead to the side of my hair and I'm going to section that out, also a straight line there. And after I was done, this is what it looks like. I went ahead and applicated the same thing to the other side. After I was done with the other side, this is what the both sides are now looking like. So after I was done with my sectioning, I went ahead to one side and I'm just going to put that away. And for the other side, I went ahead with my Echo Starter Crystal Gel. I applied a little and I'm just going to go ahead and brush it out. After brushing, I went ahead to flat twist. 
please when flat twisting make sure the flat twist is tight enough so that it doesn't get loose after i was done with one side i did the same thing to the other side after I was done flat twisting, this is what both sides are looking like. I'm going to go ahead and I'm just going to put both sides at the back of my hair with my tiny rubber band and I banded them together, making sure that it's tight enough so it doesn't get loose. And for the rest of my hair, I combed it out properly and I came back to the front of my hair and I applied some hair pins. I'm going to go ahead and lay my edges and after I was done laying my edges, this is the final result guys. So guys, thank you all for watching and please don't forget to subscribe. Let me know which of these hairstyles you'll be creating in the comment section and I'll see you in my next video. Bye guys! Hey.